At the risk of using an old and tired cliche, the future is now. Everything I'm about to show you isn't a concept, it's not a prototype. This is all AI that's working and being used in the world now. Day two of the AI summit for the world's largest tech company, NVIDIA. This is where you see the tech company's mark on the AI wave. We're working with physical AI in partnership with NVIDIA to build out these uh, autonomy solutions. Autonomy as in robots. We are already delivering the robots, actually. <laughs> like Vega, the friendly manual labor robot from Dexmate. We can move boxes in the warehouse. We can pick up components from the production line. CEO Tao Chen says Vega can lift up to 40 pounds and does not have a hard clock out time. So for example, this robot can work for like more than 20 hours per charge. That is the live feed or from get ready to ride home in an AV ride. You can use it in right hand just as a usual taxi but just fully autonomous without nobody driving it. The Texas-based company uses AI and visual technology to pilot these driverless cars. And actually, the car can see much better than people. They partnered with Uber to drive these robot taxis into Dallas starting in December. We first start deploying with a vehicle operator in the car, and then when we move stage by stage, we remove the person from the car. And uh, what is the name of the company you work with? Study Fetch. Does that help clear things up? This is the future of learning. Students just bring all of their coursework into Study Fetch, and they can create those quizzes and tests and flashcards and podcasts and video explainers and learn at their pace. It works like a personal tutor. You can ask questions. So would that work for a dog or a tiger as well? And it answers. Exactly. The same process works but for But in dogs. all this autonomy, where does this leave the human workers? If we ask the human workers to lift the heavy stuff from the ground, it's going to hurt the back. That's the point of having automation, is to have help people to do the job like much in a much easier way. Uh, this car is school for everyday commute. There will never be a replacement for teachers. Never for the experience and the intuition and the compassion that teachers have. And NVIDIA, the tech giant that hosted this entire summit, their economic influence continues to grow. Today, the company hit $5 trillion in valuation, which is more than the GDP of just about every nation in the world, except for the United States and China. In DC, I'm Matt Gregory, WUSA 9.